Hi, I'm Brad, I'm 15, and how much milk do cows produce? I'm Doug Keneally, a professor of animal science at Iowa State University. The question is, how much milk will a cow produce? How many glasses of milk will a cow produce, or how long will she produce that milk? A cow will produce milk beginning after she gives birth to her first calf. Cows are bred at about 15 months of age, and dairy cows begin producing milk at about 24 months of age. The difference in that is the nine-month period for which she uh, grows or develops her first calf. Cows will produce milk for about 10 months after they give birth to their first calf. Then we give them a two-month dry period, a period in which they're not producing milk. They get to rebuild their body, add a little fat store back, well, let's talk about that 10 months. During that 10 months of producing milk, an average cow will produce about 22 to 23,000 pounds of milk. To put that in perspective, um, that would be something on the order of about 100,000 small glasses of milk. The very best cow produced much more than that. She was in the, in the zone of about 75,000 pounds of milk. That cow produced about 140,000 containers of milk like this. On a daily basis, that 140,000 containers of milk can be viewed in a different way. That's about four to five pounds of sugar, and about an equivalent amount of fat that she puts in the milk every day, and about an equivalent amount of protein. So when you think about this bag of sugar and doing about three times that in solid material every day for 100 pounds of milk, that's a tremendous amount of genetic work. That's a tremendous amount of metabolism for that cow. What, what we do is we breed cows for high milk production. We test their mother, their father, their relatives, and, and in doing so, we have genetic values for those cows. And in America, we have selected cows for very high milk production. Uh, a good cow will produce about 100 pounds of milk per day. And she will stay in a herd for about three and a half years. Um, that would be three and a half years of those cycles of 10 months of producing milk and two months of not producing milk. But the very longest period of time she might stay in a herd for some cows could be 10, 12 or even 14 years. At the Iowa State Dairy, we had one cow who stayed in the milking herd for 14 years and had 13 baby calves. That's extreme. That's a long time. Three or four years in the milking herd is probably typical for most cows. To produce that 100 pounds of milk a day or the five pounds of sugar and the fat and the protein, a cow really can't eat enough daily to, to manage that. So cows might eat from 60 to 100 pounds of feed a day, depending upon what we feed them. And it contains water, of course, too, in that weight. But to get that amount of milk produced, a cow will actually use her own back fat. So in that 10 months of producing milk, she might use the same amount of weight as a high school football player, 200 pounds of her own back fat. And so she literally mobilizes that and utilizes that in her system to produce some of this uh, carbohydrate and protein and fat in the milk. And that's why we give her that two months lactation dry period or that break to rebuild for R&R, just like we would need, if we were runners, we'd need some time on the weekend to take a break. She needs that two months every year to rebuild her body and put some fat stores on. 